Stefan Hodo hasn't been seen in weeks. The retired Detroit police officer has been missing ever since his car and his assault rifle were used by somebody else in multiple crimes. Sean Lay is live tonight with what his family and Detroit police have to say as this search stretches on here. Sean. You can imagine so emotional from the police and Stefan Hodo's family members. We're hearing from them for the first time. We're also learning some new clues here. We're here live on Detroit's east side, but Stephen Hodo, Stefan Hodo went missing from Detroit's west side. However, we're learning tonight his car, Black Lexus, was seen over here on the east side as his family and police continue to look for him and look for some important answers. For the last two weeks, the Detroit Police Department's homicide missing persons um, has been looking for our brother in blue. Where is Stefan Hodo? His family is desperate to know. Hodo is a retired Detroit police officer missing now since at least June 30th. And if anyone knows anything or has seen him, I just ask that you come forward and call Crime Stoppers. We love him and we miss him. And I just, oh, I just, I wish somebody would come forward. Thank you. Here are the bizarre and scary details. June 30th, 13 days ago, a man caught on camera firing shots into a Detroit home, not once, but twice. Police say he was using a weapon that belongs to Hodo. The gunman was also driving the retired police officer's car. Police say there were signs of a struggle at Hodo's home, but no sign of the retired officer for nearly two weeks now. All right, back here live. More about Stefan Hodo's car. It's a 2007 Black Lexus. Again, the man with his uh, weapon firing into that home was driving Stefan Hodo's car. And police tonight are saying if you saw the car before June 30th, that's important, on the east or west side, they definitely want to hear from you. They were speaking out through Crime Stoppers today, so a $2,500 cash reward now being offered. And Kimberly, you can tell just by the emotion and the voices from the police and from family, they are desperate for a tip. They need something to help with this case. They absolutely do, Sean. I want to ask you before you go, there's a man in custody in the shootings. Is there any update that you know of on that? Yeah, the man in the video, he was mm -hmm. picked up right away by DPD. His case still being investigated. They know he's a neighbor of Stefan Hodo. They don't know if there's any connection between the two. However, they're still trying to put those pieces together, meaning they are now more than ever really hoping someone picks up the phone and gives them the tip they need. No one has to give their name ever. Back to you. Indeed. All right, Sean, thank you.